So the inspiration for this exhibition comes from a book that was published in 1955. It's called The Sweet Fly Paper of Life. So, you know, in this period of the 1950s, uh, African-American family life was not exactly something that was visible. The photographs are by um, an artist named Roy de Carava, and the text is by uh, Langston Hughes. It's almost like a fictitious family album, and there's a really sort of beautiful relationship between um, you know, what you're reading and the, and the images that surround it. So this exhibition sort of begins with that book, but it includes a number of contemporary artists who are, you know, thinking um, and sort of visualizing African-American family life, but also sort of pushing our notions of what a family is. You know, the show has, you know, a lot of different sort of representations of family, whether it's, you know, immediate family, extended family, and, you know, from, from my work, I really wanted to focus on pictures of people who have been very, very important in the sort of development of my artistic practice and myself as a, as a person. And for me, the, the really powerful thing about the piece collectively is that you see, you know, all these young, um, intelligent, you know, black people who are in their environments um, and very much in, in their space and they sort of command your, your attention in a way and I think that's something very, very powerful and you know, it's sort of set up in the way that they, they all have a sense of radical presence to me that's really beautiful and, and powerful. So. Dina Lawson was born in 1979 and has become a really you know, influential photographer. This work pictures is 48 images of her, the artist's cousin, Jasmine, um, visiting her partner in Mohawk Correctional Facility uh, with their children. Um, but what I think is, really sustains this piece is the evident care and love and the sort of bonds of family that persist in this situation. And they are, you know, despite that sort of difficult circumstances, a really kind of beautiful and touching image of a family. It's important that people are able to come to the museum and, you know, recognize something of their own life and their own experience uh, on the walls of the museum. And it's equally important for people to recognize and experience difference. I mean, I think the most powerful thing about art is that you can enter into a museum or a gallery and after seeing a show, you can go back into the world and actually see the world anew. That's my ultimate, ultimate hope is to change the way that uh, or influence the way that people see the world around them.